YouTube Hot Wheels racers back out with another amazing video. And yes, this video will be on a nice, you know, little Walmart weekend show find. As you guys know, weekends are always the weekend show where I do unboxings and all. So let's uh, pick out our cars. So, yeah, you know, so we got I'm this. I'm really surprised that we found this much at Walmart. Yeah, so my friend is going to be in this video, because why not, he was pick he picked up some too. So I'm going to leave the rest of the cars for another video, because they're all a series. Now, yeah, so let's just check out the finds that I got. These amazing three cars. So now, as I was saying, so I got Bone Shaker. This is going to be the Legends of Speed, 3 of 10. And yeah, so overall, pretty good car. Thank you, Pastor. And so far, yeah, so this car is amazing. Hopefully it does get on track. We got Volkswagen T2 pickup, another really good car. And now we got this Dodge Charger Daytona. Now, you guys are wondering like, oh wow, he got another Daytona. Doesn't he have this orange one right here? Well, if you guys do not remember, this car is, uh, you know, it's a like little- uh, banged up. Yeah, as my friend said factory screw up which i kind of find pretty interesting let's hope this blue one does not so let's get right into this so we're gonna open yeah, another fact that i like it has nicer wheels the so 5sp wheels nice and silver yeah you gotta admit those are nice so we unboxed bone shake you know what? let's just get rid of that so pretty let's just zoom in on this car because this car has a nice design so I got him to pick that one over the blue one because I saw that the blue one has like a flat paint and I prefer to see Bone Shaker in a, you know, nice red glossy paint. As you can see, it still has the same livery as the blue one, but it's still friggin' nice. Yeah, so the blue one was a mm, flat blue. Just like what he said, he chose this one. So it's easy. it wasn't a bad, it wasn't a bad find. So this is a K50 model. So this was 2017, and yeah, so let's just uh, roll that one out of there. Now, next one will be, zoom just out a bit. Ratty T1. Yeah, Volkswagen. Now this, I hope, hopefully, uh, I got this because hopefully the bone shaker will fit on the top of like the bed, hopefully. Like but, ooh, that was a good boxing. Look at that. Let's just take a Clean. whiff, let's just take a whiff. Yeah, 2017 cent, even though it's 2018. <laughs> okay. Yeah, so. All right, so let's take a look at the, let's do a little panoramic view of this baby. Any screw ups? Let's check, I'm just gonna. No, the only screw ups is the paint, how it's supposed to be designed. So this is another K50 model. Again, these are like all made in that same time. And uh, let's see, does the car fit? Please comment below. <laughs> yeah. Ish. Works. Okay. It's not, it, looks, it, it still looks good. If you had a Volkswagen Beetle, it will fit. Just give it that, okay? Or this. I think this would fit. Or yeah, the Angry Birds car. And it does. It fits really eh, well-ish. It just, it's just there. Now, the car of, like, of like the like this is the the drum roll yeah the drum roll for of cars so we have you know just you know throughout now this i like this car okay this car the detailing just like on the photo the cardboard photo it's beautiful now let's just oh another fresh boxing can we just take a nice 2017 away so yeah just toss that away where did that land yo that disappeared. Why over there? Okay. Well, whatever. So this car is um is beautiful. That's I have to say. It's actually not screwed up either, and it rolls. Oh no, we got a factory cut oh. on the front. Oh. Yeah, it's oh, not man. so good. We could never get another perfect <gasps> Daytona, can we? Okay, another factory cut right here. Another one there. This car is harshly damaged. Ah. Oh. So, so far, we will never find that perfect Daytona. So, Hot Wheels, please 
please uh, do some quality control on your Daytona line. It's 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 really annoying the findings. Yeah. So now damage. my friend is gonna unbox his amazing cars. All right. So, so this is my finds. The first one's gonna be a uh, then and now series. I actually recently picked up an R33. And then he's got. I'm just gonna stand them up. So. Hopefully everyone gets to see these. And we got our um, pre-opened. So we have actually a funny story about this car. If you guys are wondering why is it pre-opened, and it is, you guys have to admit, look how like clean it broke. Yeah, like, like the <laughs> seal does not smell good because it's uh, it's been opened and it hit the floor of Walmart a few times. But he dropped the car. In the package, and, it, and it just opened, <laughs> it like open. so happy the car did not. Okay, you know, you know, you know, just like screw that right uh, now. Yeah, just screw that. But like, he'll go. He'll talk about these cars in the so unboxing. It, this is out of all of these finds. This is my favorite because just look at the detailing on this thing. Like, look at those beautiful gray MC5 wheels. They're actually fully painted for once. I really have a uh, a pet peeve with Hot Wheels just doing the ring around the wheel. And look at the base, the detail, look at the exhaust. This is a K50 car, I think. Is it? Yep, it's a K50, so it's a 2017. Yeah, so I'm for sure all the cars have that are from 2017 are K50s. We're going to go over that sooner or later. But through. Just, just to take a look at how clean this, I'm actually going to keep this. <laughs> well, yeah, you got to keep that, like that's hands on. I keep all cards, but yeah. But that's the nicest one you guys, okay. As you guys saw, Anyways. we do enjoy Easter, so toss that over there too. My second favorite would be this 180SX. See, this is a nice car. Look at that, that is beautiful. Look at those wheels. I have no idea what those wheels are called. I'll have to look that up later. But it is a Nightburners 180SX. It's got an Advan livery on it. And uh, this car is from, let's just check quickly. 2017 model, not bad for a store that isn't so good. Well, pretty good. So here. Well, Walmart typically, you know, they do that. They, they get a lot of errors. Yeah. Well, yeah. So we we were gonna do a video inside the store, but overall we were just like a lot of people were staring at us and being like, "What the hell are these people doing?" Right? Yeah, they were, they were watching us like crazy, like vultures. There was like three different people, right? Yeah, it was. Uh, some girl looked at us and she was, and they were walking up and down the aisle as we were just looking for some cars. Cause you know, we, our, we have to take care of our fans and make sure there's good products like content. So to get that, we need really good cars. Yeah. So yeah. unbox this thing, bud. All right, let's see my first time at grave, uh, race grooves, uh, method. First time I agree. Race, yeah. Cause race grooves does. Uh, okay. Well that did not work, but take a whiff. We're just gonna wait. Doesn't smell like nothing. Okay, it doesn't smell like nothing, but probably if you get like, if you're like one of those like really like smell, like people who have a strong scent. So this is a 180SX and so far it looks absolutely spotless. As you guys can see, the headlights are like just the sleepy up. eyes. Yeah, like what he said. <laughs> That's but, what they call them, the JDM fans. They call it like sleepy eyes and I, I see why. I like the window though, that windshield. Got a nice twin exhaust on the back here. Nice uh, little quick look at the base. It and does it, does it say K50? Uh, no. I think it says K50 anywhere. What about the back? Cause I'm for sure though. Oh, it does. It's just really fainted. All right. So wait, let's just uh, night burner, blah, blah, blah. Okay, so the box. Doesn't say anything. So if anybody knows what these wheels are called, please put it in the comment section. Cause we might even modify our cars. That's how for real we are. Like amazing. But obviously not this car. Yeah, obviously not. That. So let's just uh, put those two cars. Right, so now I, I freaked. I nearly freaked out at this one. I have the the Kaffa Racer, but this I've never found before. The Magnus Walker 911, and there's two of them in the Walmart. Only yes, two. I was gonna buy that one, but I'm like, no way, man. I'll wait like another month there. It's, it's still gonna be there. I'm pretty sure. So now we're gonna see if it has so K. Like yeah, if it's gonna have a K50 on the back. Pretty sure it's maybe. I don't think we can see it through the plastic. Though. Yeah, we're gonna have to unbox this. All right. So let's do this. Attempt. Race groove style. We'll just regular unboxing. Yes. 
Not bad. Uh, eh. Take a whiff. Must take a whiff. I smell the car. Okay, <laughs> that's good. So uh, look at that. That is flawless. No errors whatsoever. It has K50 on it. And it's flawless. Like, yeah. Look at that. That is nice. The British flag on top too. Like hands down. Like that. who does? Let's, who? Let's, let's do a little close up on that. The hood. The, the Porsche logo. I'm trying to get that amazing. I'm surprised Hot Wheels put this much detail into a main line. There we go. Yeah, but overall, really nice car. Gotta say, amazing f find. And yes, we're gonna have a video on the other cars that you guys will hopefully enjoy. And we will test these cars in another video. Right now, we, we're kind of short on time for now. Yes. So now we're just gonna unbox this baby. This is a uh, Then and Now R30... No, 2000 GTR Skyline. Yeah. And I do have the R33 version of this one. But I'm not sure. Could you leave a comment in the below that if it comes with different wheels? I'm not sure of these wheels. I've only seen these wheels on like fully detailed cars like the Bone Shaker there. and Yeah, and see like Nova. even this car, it has the same wheels. So, but yeah, let's just crack this thing open. Yeah. Okay, not bad. Fail. No, it's not a fail. Okay, so. All right, screw it. Take a whiff. No, I'll take the whiff. Oh yeah, you can smell it, boys. If you guys want to take the whiff, here we go. If you guys are real Hot, Field, Hot Wheels fans, just take that whiff. We're gonna. That's what it's like to be uh, in a Walmart. Yeah, you know, what? let's actually do us. Continue the video in this package. So this is what it's like to be uh, not bought, and then somebody else buys the other Hot Wheels. Yeah. That you hate. So I'll just turn know. the car to the side because I think we're going to be running on like time a bit. So does it say K50? I think it does. Uh, wait, let me point out. Okay, it says it right there. K50. Yeah, I see it. I just, look at fans the, don't see it. Look at the insane amount of detail on the bottom of this. Okay. Apparently this is not. Oh, there we go. We see the K50. 50 right there. Amazing. So now just show the rear end of the car. And look, it is a 2011 style base and it still has the 2011 style writing. See, it has the italic font. I always like that italic font on the 2012 models. Yeah, so let's get a little 360 of the car, shall we? So overall, beautiful, beautiful. tampos, beautiful wheels, nicely painted door handles. Oh, get a close up on those taillights. Yeah, like hands down what makes the car amazing. The tail lights. And it's actually a separate piece as it's just Skyline right there it is amazing. You got a Hot Wheels hot, logo. Yeah, on right the up there. Then there's the gas. I'm guessing that's the gas cap. Uh, right. Yeah, there. that's the gas cap. Right there, gas cap. Nice door handles. And yeah, so that will end this video on our I highly recommend buying all four of these cars. These are really good for your collection. Yeah, that's, and me, if you're crazy, like, you know, okay, that did not work as planned, but okay. if you guys are really, like, interested in finding these cars, we even, I'm even thinking of making this, like, a business sort of thing, like, selling them a lot, it's depending on what cars, but yeah, so this is the cool pickup find we have, so please comment, like, and subscribe for more videos, and yeah, Hot Wheels Racers is out.